So I missed the spot. Some kids never grow up. They just get bigger. Oh, I missed another spot. And it just so happens that every now and then, their toys do too. It's very tricky to make a curve with a gridded pattern. Every kid at their light bright certainly felt like an artist. It's a real piece of art. But no kid. Of course, when I was six and seven. Ever dreamed quite this big. Hopefully, and I believe it will happen, Guinness will deem this the largest light bright ever done. More than half a million pegs, all sorted by hand, all placed by artist Takumba Aiken and an army of anxious fingers. This is what the light bright will look like when it's finished, but this project is about much more than one big idea. They hope to inspire many. The best idea, the biggest idea to make St. Paul great. The work was commissioned by the St. Paul Foundation to kick off their million dollar challenge, a privately funded effort to give one idea one big head start. Everyone can enter. What we're looking for are great ideas, and we think we're going to get a whole lot of them. I call it a bright idea <laughs> because of the light bright. More than 300 volunteers have come by, from the homeless to federal judges. So we were talking about the biking infrastructure. Brainstorming ideas on how to bring St. Paul together. Humongous community swimming pool. <laughs> while working on a project. That's going to take you a really long time, Gus. That's already doing so. So is it about the art? Not at all. Is it about the initiative? Most definitely. Artists are often described as seeing the world through a different set of eyes. Everybody sees color different. Everybody sees everything a little different. But few artists see color. Blues get to be strange when they're around grays and greens and all that. The way Takumba doesn't. Pour the whole thing of pink peach into the orange bin. And then somebody said, why did you do that? And I'm like, why did I do what? But he figures the same way a colorblind artist can create the world's largest light bright, someone else will see a brand new vision for St. Paul. I just wanted to create the spirit of St. Paul, the energy, the feel of it. In St. Paul, Mitch Pittman, 45 Local News.